total years of college. I have had, I had four years of undergrad and then I've been here for three and some. So I've had seven and a little bit. Um, and then I have the rest of this year and another year. So altogether I'll have eight years of college. In undergrad, I actually studied animal biology. Um, I was big on animals and environmental stuff, so I knew that I wanted to stay somewhere in that area. So it's kind of been a switch from studying animals to studying people and water, but it's a good one. I'm working on examining water demand drivers up in the Spokane region, and that means looking at physical drivers like precipitation, so how much water is actually in the system, as well as socioeconomic things, so like income, how much money can people spend on water, um, who can afford irrigation systems, things like that. And so we're trying to get at, at all of those different things in order to better predict water use in the future up in that area. Right now I'm teaching Environmental Science 275, which is Sustainable Watersheds and Communities. And it isn't a lab class, I just do two lectures a week. It's like lecture and discussion. What do I do when I'm not teaching? I'm planning class a lot, which is what I've been doing all morning. I've been helping with some grant writing for some larger National Science Foundation grants and wrapping up one that I was funded through a couple years ago. I'm done with coursework, which is really nice because it gives me time to work on my own research. Um, right now I'm gearing up to edit a paper to get ready for a conference in December. What else do I do? There, there's fun in there. <laughs> um, I, I have a couple of roommates and they're both grad students, so we, we carve out little bits of time together. <laughs>